Hello and welcome. I am Arumba. Thank you for joining me. Let's play some more Factorissimo multiplayer with Steejo. How are you doing, Steejo? I am well. I am very well. This mod is just. Yep. Re renewed your vigor for Factorio? You probably. It wasn't like I'd lost any vigor for Factorio, but yeah. It's pretty cool, dude. Yeah, this is awesome. This is this is the most fun I've had in Factorio in a little, in in a while. Yeah. Just, it really changes everything. Okay. And so then, do you have that factory? Do you want to come in here? I need that that other factory. Uh, yeah. Just give me a little second. Ah, oh, fine. If I have to. I'm just making a factory that makes pipes because I'm sick of pocket crafting them. Yeah, I've been making lots of pipes right now, making these extra fifty-six boilers. There we go. We've got a factory for pipes. Yay! Now we just need... I, we need another 60 steam engines. I have, I have 10 in my pocket. We've got 10 outside right now. And we're going to make a factory that... This, this is actually going to make 40 megawatts, I think, of power. This is going to be 80 boilers. Each, uh, each set makes... Uh, each, each set of 10 makes 5 megawatts. Yeah, should, yeah it's fine. Yeah. So, 40 megawatt factory building. And if I understand correctly, what you can do is you can copy the complete entity if you just use a blueprint. And you like put this that factory building. Sad. I don't know if it's gonna like cheat though and like just give us all the stuff that's inside for free, which would be kind of cheap, but... Yeah. Eh, I don't know. We shall see, I suppose. That would be kind of cheap. Unfortunately. Oh, I see you gave me the factory building? Okay. Yes. I popped it in your pocket. I want this to look nice, so I'm going to use... Slightly more resources than are needed. Yeah, okay, fair enough. This is where we have to suspend our disbelief a little bit about factories within factories, but hey, whatever. <laughs> it's so cool, I don't care. <sighs> Right, and oh my god, I'm making pipes. Nope, that's the worst thing ever. It's because underground pipes are so bloody expensive. Yeah, I need to. I'm gonna go steal some of your pipe from that factory up there. Oh gosh. It's hideous. It's my pipe. What have you made? It's hideous. <laughs> <laughs> We need better, like, access to water or something, I don't know. It's because we're using this one tiny little frickin' pond. <laughs> yeah, I know, that's kind of dumb of us. We can heat! Here's the thing, though, is we could just move everything. So easily, if we just hook up all the water yeah. connections again. I think it's funny how, uh... We're just spending so much time now focusing entirely on uh, this one little aspect, power. <laughs> yeah. But it's going to be great. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. There we go. We have... This factory looks insane from outside. It's just all these pipes leading into it at each side. It looks awesome. I love it. <laughs> That's insane. Oh, we don't have any actual coal leading into the thing. No, not yet. That's just gonna come in from the top, though. God. Yeah, these look pretty cool. Right, circuit network's finished. Um, do we want solar energy? Uh, not if we're making a 40 megawatt factory buildings um, <laughs> let's uh let's go engine and we'll start pushing our way towards robots and 
trains. Okay, yeah. I'm, one thing I'm very excited to see is what happens to the pollution map once we get this thing done. Yeah, because this should be pumping out an awful lot of pollution. Or none. Or none at all. Wah, wah, wah. I run out of pipe. There we go. As did I. I don't know how I ah. I don't have enough underground pipe now. Like how did I? I feel like I I've, I've done that thing where I have an odd number. How did this happen? Yeah, you'll you'll just notice that you've got a daft one somewhere. Yeah. Oh. I I also had an odd number, so I probably finished something <laughs> that you started. <laughs> oh, I've made a terrible mistake. <laughs> <laughs> This looks freaking gorgeous, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, more pipe goes here, okay. And yeah, I'm back to an even number now. Okay, so yeah. we just need coal. <laughs> Lots of coal. We I don't even know if, if a yellow belt of coal is going to be enough from here. Probably not. Let's see it work! <laughs> Actually, like, I haven't been inside. Oh, there's nothing in this other factory, okay. No, I still need to make the 60 steam engines. I've got enough <laughs> iron on me for 49. So I'll get it. I'm gonna get started on them, but... Did you end up making a, a gear factory on its own? I'm gonna do that. No, I didn't. I'll just... <laughs> I'll just sit in here with a big stupid smile on my face right now. <laughs> as just we, watching all this. As well you should. <laughs> There's 50 of them. I'm gonna get started pocket crafting this crap. I just love these little dimensions. I feel so safe and happy in here. Magnificent. Alright, engines are finished. Um. Okay. What to get? Yeah. Trains, funnily enough, used to be something I never used in Factorio. No. Yeah, the um the issue being the base spawning, like the base um ore spawn. Yeah. Meant that you could pretty much finish the game without any need. Yep. But with RSO, then. Yeah. That's where it all changes. Yeah, and trains are fun. And we will need RSO for all of our factory factories. Factory Simo. <laughs> all this effort just to make a. Uh, an, a 40 <laughs> megawatt power thing right now. So the only thing that I'm, get, I'm working on is trying to get this one thing done. I've got 20 on me, we've got 10 outside. That's 30. We need another 50 steam engines. God. That's 10 more. Okay. Need these gears. Now oh, you made another gear factory. Nice. Yeah. I'm just stealing some of the pipe right now to make it work because uh, I don't. I had I had a bunch of extra iron on me. So yeah. Okay, now I've got 30, 40. Okay, we're halfway there. And I pretty much have enough uh, gears and, and uh, pipe to actually finish this, which is awesome. So I've got all, all 40 more queued up. This is crazy. Really all I have to say about that. <laughs> and the best part is we don't even need to use power lines in there. It's so nice. Yeah, I like that. It changes so many builds, though, because a lot of builds that you always use, use power lines. You can fit seven across. Actually, uh, we're gonna run into an issue here. I don't think we have enough room, do we? Oh no. Yeah, look at this. Even if we do something like this, you need. Uh, Could not just put, just fill up this entire space with them. 
Yeah, but look, like... Wait. No, it will fit, holy crap. Wait, I did that wrong. Yeah, yeah that's... It barely fits, you're right though. It does, it, it will fit. And with long reach, we can actually manipulate this factory pretty easily. Um, and then this one's gonna come down to here. Wait, no, I, I feel like we're getting off a little bit. I don't know, Stijo. I don't know if it's all gonna fit. I don't think so. How is it that it... It's one, two, three, four... No, I can't fit four. I can't double this. There's no way I can fit this many in here. Why don't, like... I mean, I could do the seven. I, I mean, to utilize the space, I probably have to. Yeah, I put... Just literally fill up the space. All right, let's see what happens. So that's the first one. I'm gonna start hooking them up. That's the first one. And this one will go as far in as we can without intersecting the other set. So one, two, three. Yeah, okay, it'll work. Nice. That's, that's what it looks like. We have successfully made a 40 megawatt factory within a factory. <laughs> I'm going to get some pipes and pipe all this up. Oh, you're making unlimited underground. Oh, was I? What? You silly sausage. I wasn't making underground. Underground pipe? Oh, underground pipe, gotcha. Okay. Thought you meant underground belt. Have oh. I done my math wrong? I think I, I don't think I have enough... Uh... Oh, it's the 10 steam engines that are already assembled, that's why. Yeah. Okay, I didn't think I did And then math. the interesting thing is seeing if we can actually get power out of a factory instead of just in. I shouldn't I, see why not. I think it'll work. I'm optimistic. Gosh, there's like, there's not going to be any space in here at all. Literally none. <laughs> okay, um... Well, it's hooked up. Now we've got the last 10. Available performance, performance none. Okay. Yeah, apparently the only production we're getting is off of 10 steam engines. No. No. Sad face. Like, why are the top ones not connected? Like, the top ones are saying available performance zero. There's no water coming in from the left. Why is there no water? Oh, these pipes. These not reach? These don't reach. Derp. Um, but why work on it if it's not going to work? I, we spent so much time on this, damn it! Um... Do they need power lines? To hook up to the grid? I mean, they are connected via power, so... No, I just... I don't think they work inside. Why wouldn't they, though? That really sucks. I mean, I'm show Yeah, it's shown available performance, and performance none. They're just not being asked to work. What if, just let's just test this, what if you connect them inside the first factory? Maybe it's an issue with uh, the factory within a factory. Here, I'm gonna put like one steam engine, like, here. No, he's not working either. Well, we could still, we could still bury all of the boilers inside of a factory building and just take carry the carry the power across yeah i mean yeah we could keep this and then have the output like the the boilers outputting i suppose well we uh we're sad very now sad. very sad <laughs> kind of sad this was so pretty 
I was so excited for a 40 megawatt portable little, literally one factory, but then another factory inside it. And all we'd have to feed it yeah. was coal and water, and just bam, 40 megawatts. It was so cool. Oh, it's really sad watching you disassemble I know. all as well. <laughs> it's miserable. So apparently we oh. gotta put the steam engines in the real world. Okay. I mean, and we can have... Oh, we can't even do that. We can only have, like... No, we gotta cut it in half. Four? Yeah. yeah. We gotta cut it in half, because oh, we don't have enough... Shit. Well, we could, do, we could do six, in theory, because we've got twelve... We've got twelve inputs and outputs. So twelve waters in, or six waters in, six waters out. We can do six per factory building, but we'd have to completely change that's, the layout that we're using. That's just uneven and yucky. Well, it's thirty megawatts, so it's still a pretty good number. Yeah, but if you put four in, four out, it's water goes in one side of a factory, the hot water comes out the other side of the factory, and it looks nice. Yeah, but you could also do the top two on the left being waters in, and the top two on the right being waters out, and then it's still. Symmetrical. Mm. You just you just don't like it, huh? Yeah. You rather just do four? Yeah. I'm gonna just go cry for a while, that's all I'm gonna do. Yeah. Now what if you were inside a factory, right? And you have a pocket robo port. Can the robots help you deconstruct stuff inside a factory building? I wouldn't see why not. Cause like, they'll follow you, right? Like, they're gonna be in here, with you. Yeah. This is a real place, somewhere on the map. Or is it? <laughs> bum -a bum Inception, is it really real, or are we just in a dream? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna have to go watch that movie after this recording session today. <laughs> <laughs> I think you've got my other factory, don't you? Yeah, I picked it oh, up. Oh yeah, power switches! I have never used them yet. No, neither have I. Somebody actually uh, made something where they were like, look at this, I made this thing that uh, measures the, free the, the throughput of a belt, and if the belt throughput is, is uh, blocked and there's like nothing moving, then it turns off all of the, the factories so that they don't have any idle drain. It's like, wow, that's a lot of work. <laughs> Just to save a little <laughs> bit of idle power drain. <sighs> it's, uh, it's a lot of work there. It's a lot of work there you did. Saying that, I did spend like a billion episodes of the last series just making our oil trains ever so slightly more efficient. Yeah, I remember. <laughs> do you, so, uh... Do I you can't really say anything about being <laughs> a lot of work for not much payoff. Yeah. Do you want your, uh, this factory building back? No. Fucking no. Not this one? You want a new one? Yeah. Blackjack and hookers. Pick up some steel. Oh, I can't, because you changed the steel. <laughs> there. I've turned steel back on. You okay. can't stop me. Alright. Although it does mean that all this pipe that's getting built up here is no longer going to be pipe well there's the uh the output water hot water now uh... can you tell him you're not as excited left. yeah definitely <laughs> definitely i am too all right so although it might still reduce the yeah the pollution all happens the inside pollution. so yeah let's see if we go like here and then, we do need to run power lines now. Wow, this, this is going to take up so much more space. <laughs> That's bullshit! <laughs> oh my god. Yes! See? Exactly! Stupid thing. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, and fuck you. There we go. Ah, <sighs> I know what you mean. You don't want to play this mod anymore, do you? 
It's rubbish. <laughs> <laughs> fix! Please fix! Must fix! Please. Please fix. Okay, and then, then we gotta go even further down. Oh, hold on. I lined up... I think I lined it up a little bit off-center. Shoot. I did. Yeah, big poop. No, I should have lined up the steam engine. The bottom edge. No. Yes. Broke my steel tool. Anyway, if you want to take us out. Yeah, alright, okay. Well, we're gonna go cry in the corner for a while, but we'll be back. <laughs> same time, same place tomorrow. We'll have more power, and it'll be good. And we'll find other things we can stick inside the factory. So, yeah, lot check. And hookers. Alright, thanks yeah. for watching everyone. We'll see you again tomorrow. See you soon. Bye-bye.